believe our new Toyota Celicas deserve to be the import car of the year. I couldn't agree more. You asked for it. Motor Trend Magazine's 1978 import car of the year. The new Toyota Celicas, the car of the 80s. Celica won this award in competition with some of the best cars in the world. For its styling, which is an aerodynamic work of art. The interior comfort and decor, and the quality control of its construction. And the road test that scored big for Toyota Celica in acceleration, braking, precise handling, and fuel economy. I am so happy. Don't cry. The new Toyota Celicas have earned the right to be Motor Trend Magazine's import car of the year for 78. If you can find a better built small car than this Toyota, buy it. Congratulations, Toyota. You asked for it, you got it, Toyota. You got it, Toyota. You got it, Toyota. I'm going to keep on doing that till I get it right. Yeah, I work hard and I play hard. And I use STP gas treatment. You just pump it in your tank and it goes to work cleaning your carburetor. I take good care of my wheels on account of I'm cheap. I bet you are too. Try it. Whoops. Try it. Let's pause for local station identification. This is Television Sports USA, the Mislu Television Network. It took a lot of hard work to start this business and a couple of lucky breaks to get it going. But now, for a variety of reasons, it's paying off. Like my Austin Savings ACT account. Last year's average deposits of $30,000 earned me more than $1,500, money I wouldn't have earned otherwise. Enough for me and my wife to take a vacation in London this year. She thinks it's romantic. Actually, it's just good business. Austin Savings. We're the largest because we work harder for more people. Live mannequins model bright spring fashions daily between 3 and 7 as we color it spring at North Cross Mall. The most important part of any car is the brake system. It's also the most neglected. Many people unknowingly drive cars with brakes that are dangerously unsafe. At Brake Check, we will professionally check your brakes absolutely free. That means you're under no obligation whatsoever. If a brake problem is discovered, and if you'd like us to do the work, you can be sure of a fair price and that we'll do the job right. Stop in to have your brakes checked. You'll like our price. It's free. This is Channel 7, KTBC-TV in Austin. Head coach Norm Sloan. It's been a run em up and down the court, shoot em up contest thus far, and thus far it's Texas, which has canned about 12 or 14 layups thus far. The fast break has been working, and they've been breaking the press and playing very well. Wow, there are ceremonies going on here at halftime of the Garden. And there, uh, Fred Gruninger, the athletic director of Rutgers University, to the left of your screen, Larry Jarashotti of the NIT committee and athletic director at Wagner is in the middle there. They're making a presentation of botany jackets to those gentlemen. That's Daryl Royal, the athletic director at the University of Texas. Well, as Casey, the athletic director at North Carolina State is being acknowledged. He's just committee your picture. And the athletic director of Georgetown is Frank Rianzo who will be the final man into your picture. All right, standing by in Mislu Television Control is Don Tollefson with this report on the Pepsi Hot Shots. Thank you, gentlemen. I hope those of you who have enjoyed the first half of the NIT Finals will also enjoy our halftime feature. And I think you will, because it is a tribute to the kids. And I know as a sports fan myself, I love watching youngsters play sports because they do it for the pure fun involved. Our halftime tribute is brought to you by Pepsi. Have a Pepsi day. Right now, without further ado, let's take a look at our tribute to the future basketball stars of America. Hot shot! Show us what you got! Last year, the Pepsi-Cola Company and the National Basketball Association joined together in a unique venture called Pepsi NBA Hotshot. And today, millions of youngsters are benefiting from this dynamic program. 
As you can see, our hotshot contestants do much more than just shoot baskets. Here at last year's quarterfinals in New Orleans, these aspiring Dr. J's and Pistol Pete's are having the time of their lives. They're meeting the stars, they're making friends from all over, and they're involved in a learning experience that goes far beyond basketball. These youngsters are the cream of the crop. They advanced through highly competitive tournaments held in NBA cities, and they came to the Superdome in New Orleans to show off their skills. We'll see those in just a moment, but before we get to that, let me point out that the real beauty of the Pepsi NBA hotshot competition is that all the kids benefit. No matter how far a youngster advances, he or she is learning about healthy competition, hard work, and physical fitness. And most importantly, they're having a lot of fun. This program deserves an awful lot of credit for being a real investment in our youth. The objective in Hot Shot is to score as many points as you can in one minute. Special Hot Shot theme music times the competition. Starting at half court, a youngster shoots baskets from five hot spots on a basketball court. There are different point values ranging from two to five points, and each hot spot depends on the distance and the angle. Bonus points are awarded if a player attempts shots from all five hot spots, regardless of whether or not he or she makes the basket. There are two layup points allowed worth two points each. One point is subtracted for each dribbling or motion violation. As you can see, they had the preliminary competition before an NBA game. There was a sparse crowd, just the parents on hand, but everything was building towards the excitement which would come later that evening, when at halftime of an NBA basketball game, these hotshot youngsters would have an opportunity to compete. The hotshot competition is fierce, but it is friendly, and that is something that the NBA and Pepsi stress. They want these youngsters to really be aware of good sportsmanship because they know it's something that can be applied to each and everything the youngsters do. Right now, let's continue our visit way down yonder in New Orleans. <laughs> These are the NBA stars, players like Pistol Pete Maravich and all the rest. But right now, let's take another look at stars of a different age group, the Pepsi Hotshot Kids. Pepsi Hotshots actually run by more than 1,200 separate youth organizations, ranging from small church groups to major city recreation departments, like those in New York City and Los Angeles. Hotshot is open to both boys and girls anywhere in the country, 9 to 18 years old, who are not varsity players. The names of the ultimate hotshot winners are enshrined in the NBA Hall of Fame. But here's the important news. Awards are made to each and every youngster in the program, from playground certificates to distinctive trophies for the national winners. Look for Pepsi NBA hotshot information at your local Department of Recreation or other youth service organization this summer. And right now, let's take a close look at the competition with the actual music they compete to. Show us what you got. Once again, that address for more information on the Pepsi Cola Hot Shot program, Pepsi Cola Hot Shot, Purchase New York, 10577, and you'll get this very, very informative booklet, which will help your youngster get involved. I think at this point, all of us should agree that it is the kids, after all, who make it worthwhile. You know, we have more basketball excitement coming up for you on the Ms. Lou Television Network. Next weekend, from St. Louis, we're going to have the Coaches East-West All-Star Game, and a couple of guys on the squads are going to be Butch Lee and Phil Ford, two definite basketball superstars. That'll be coming to you on many of these Ms. Lou stations. We are going to be rejoining Don Crickey, Bucky Waters, and Howard David at Madison Square Garden for the NIT Finals. But first, let's have a word from Pepsi-Cola. Pepsi way, la, la, la. come on, come on, come on, and have a Pepsi day. You found a place to celebrate, 
Pepsi's cold food is great. Come on, come on and have a Pepsi day. You're the Pepsi generation. Have a Pepsi day. Zonk, if you want a date, get in shape. Shape? I'm solid steel. Uh-uh. Shick shape, Zonk. Chic shape. Get clean, get close, get comfort too. Get your face in chic shape. Click in Chic Super 2, the only twin blades Teflon coated for incredibly comfortable close shaves. Great shape, Zonk. That's chic shape. That's Super 2. We're back at Madison Square Garden in New York, halftime, 54-39. The Longhorns of Texas lead the Wolfpack of North Carolina State. I'm Howard David, along with Bob Perlstein, the vice president of SFM Media Services, the advertising agency for Fram. Bob, I don't want to talk to you. We can talk anytime. I'd rather talk to the client at this moment. And he's Ted Graham, who's the zone manager for the Fram Automotive Division. Ted, we're delighted to have you with us at halftime of the NIT, the 41st NIT. Thank the people you, the people that are watching right now see you holding a trophy which we might want to hold up a little bit higher this this is the just the middle of the fram trophy that will be presented to the player giving the outstanding performance both uh, offensively rebounding and overall floor play we might want to talk more about the fram trophy itself well howard this trophy has been in existence for seven years uh, it's been awarded to such notable people in the sports world as oj simpson uh, kyle Rote jr uh, and such celebrities as King Olaf of Norway, uh, just to name a few. All right, Ted, why has Fram gotten so heavily involved in sports? Well, Howard, our company, like this country, uh, you know, we're depending upon the youth of America for our future, as is the whole country. Uh, and we want to recognize the youth of America with this trophy, which has been given to these other famous people. Right. How long has Fram been involved, uh, you know, in sports and in presenting awards? Well, we've been in, involved in sports in uh, ver to various degrees for many years. This particular trophy has been around for seven years, Howard. Ted Graham, we're delighted to have you with us at halftime to make the presentation of the Outstanding Performance Award and the Fram Award, and uh, we hope you enjoy the second half of tonight's game. Thanks very much. Ted Graham, the zone manager of Fram Automotive Division. Bob Perlstein, the vice president of SFM Media Services, the agency for Fram Automotive. We'll have more halftime activities following these brief messages from our local stations. What makes KVET, one of America's great radio stations, the best country music in the world? Outstanding personalities. Jim Travis, Arlie Duff, Sammy Allred, Penny Reeves, Jerry K. Green, Mark Jones, and Lydia Anderson. One of the state's best news departments with Jim Ribble and sports with Larry Carlson. Austin's only radio professional weather staff anchored by James C. Fiddler. Just some of the reasons why the 24-hour country giant, KVET, is truly one of America's great radio stations. You didn't sign on with the best firm in town because you wanted a free ride. If your work's not done at quitting time, you stay until it's finished. Okay, so your golf game's not as good as some of the other guys you work with. But then, you're not going to wait 20 years to get your name on the door. You expect more from yourself and the people you do business with. We know. We're your bank. Citibank. Magic. It's a whole new world of magic. It's the new ice cream. A dazzling jubilee of fun and color. Ice cream. Beauty in motion. Dramatic illusions. Magic. Great family entertainment. Ice cream. Ice cream. Magic. The Ice Capades come to Austin April 13th to 16th for six performances at the UT Special Events Center. Call 471-7733 for information. The score at halftime of the 41st National Invitational Basketball Tournament is Texas 54 and North Carolina State 39. Stay tuned for the second half of the 1978 National Invitational Basketball Championship Finals. Well, the game was tied, but luck was on our side. Now it's all behind. Got Blue Ribbon on my mind. I've got Pat's Blue Ribbon on my mind. More and more 
lately I've find I've got taste for a living I'm thinking cold blue ribbon I've got that blue ribbon on my mind Naturally good paps A lot to look forward to at Fram, we've taken what we've learned about babies like these and designed a super air filter for cars. Inside a normal car filter, outside an extra filter. In tests, compared to our normal single air filter, the Fram with the extra filter lasted 50% longer. So we call it the Fram Extra Life. Why not put one in? It costs no more, and it saves a lot later. Fram and Autolite are Bendix companies. The second half of tonight's NIT Basketball Championship is brought to you by Pepsi-Cola and your local Pepsi-Cola bottler. Have a Pepsi day. Toyota, the official car of the NIT Basketball Championship, hopes you're enjoying today's game. You asked for it, you got it, Toyota. Fram, makers of oil, air, and fuel filters, windshield wipers, and Autolite spark plugs. And by Pap Blue Ribbon Beer, naturally brewed Paps, a lot to look forward to. Turtle Wax, the world's largest selling liquid car wax. New improved hard shell formula, cleans, polishes, protects in one easy operation. Turtle Wax with a hard shell finish. Soothing, refreshing Sepacol is called the professional mouthwash used by more physicians, and more is used by hospitals than any other brand. For spring 78, let Botany 500 tailor your wardrobe, American style, from our Chase, Bentley, and Cartier collection.